So welcome back to the Spiders Web. And in this video we're looking at the mercenary crossbowmen. We have two types of crossbowmen. We have the ones that are standing. And the ones that are kneeling down. The only difference between the two is that the ones that are kneeling you have to glue another leg on. You only have one leg and you have to use you have to uh, glue the one down that is uh, kneeling but just to save time I'm showing how I've construct one of the ones that are standing quick video just bang some glue on the feet Sorry if I sound a bit breathless, it's because I am. <laughs> there we are, that's one job done. Next, what we can do is pop some glue there and put the head on. I could turn the head any way you want to. I think I might have him, have him looking that way this time. And then on top of the head, we have a helmet. Oops, everything's going here way you now. Because I put the helmet on a bit wrong. Never mind. There we are. That's better. There we go. And now we'll have glue on that arm and we can place a crossbow like so. Wait for a few seconds and then put on this side and underneath. And then we can add, oh god, if my fingers would work. I'm making these as easy as I can. Um, because I'm currently struggling with a bit of a fibro flare up and I'm just trying to concentrate on things and keep my mind working um, there we are and next we have these two pieces here. Now there's no set place on the... Let's lift them up so you can see them. We have a knife and a quiver uh, crossbow bolt. Now there's nowhere on the instructions does it say where to put these. So I've decided on each one I'll put the crossbow bolt pouch on the back. Whether it's the right place to put it or not, I don't know. And not only do I not know, I don't care either. And I'll just see which side is the most easiest to put the dagger. And, oops. I'll put it to that side. Sometimes I'll have it slightly at an angle, sometimes I'll have it straight. But there we are. That's how I've put together all of these. I said the only difference being is with the um, kneeling ones where I have to glue on an extra leg. Not an extra leg, but the second leg I'll have to glue on. So, there we are. That is it for... Um, these ones. 
So we've done the ranged units for the spires. Um, so I think the next one we're going to be doing for the spires will be something like the um, force grown clones. We may do them yet, I don't know. But all the ones we've done so far need spraying and then painting so we will work out what to do um, later on. But that's it for this video. I hope you've enjoyed it. Until next time, as always, stay safe and take care. God bless and bye for now.